Dr. Reginald Rice from the Aesthetic Center of El Dorado Hills. This is a big day. We have been showing you other videos in process of our office, but guess what? Shock of shocks, we actually moved in. So I'm really excited to show the audience of my previous patients of what exactly we've accomplished and of course why we built the Aesthetic Center and so on and so forth. So let's go take a tour. So this is the outside. We've got the outside patio that I'll show you from the other side. Some of it's not completely done, so we've got some work to do, but we've only been in five days, five working days. So let's go in and, and just show you the reception. Welcome to the Aesthetic Center. So we've got a, a sales area over here where we're gonna show off all of our products and some funner stuff. We're bringing in Oxygenetics, we've got SkinCeuticals, and then we've got some Jane Iredale that we're happy to provide as well, just to kind of round out all the services that our patients have been asking us for. So this is our reception, and we've got our salt wall over there, which I'm really excited about. We wanted to put these in. We've got them in several different spots, and the whole idea behind those is they produce a bunch of healthy ions to help us get rid of free radicals and just make us generally healthier as we breathe. So our outdoor area, we're gonna have an infrared sauna out there. It's not in yet. We're gonna have just some outdoor activity space, maybe some yoga or some classes and so on and so forth when it's a little bit cooler. We've got a little refreshment bar here. So, and then we've got the spa side entrance over there where we'll go into the treatment rooms from that side. And then on this door is where the, the medical side is where surgery and Botox are. So. Let's go in this side first. This is our consult room. It's where we'll meet, talk to patients about the, the various things they want to get done to rejuvenate their skin or to improve their self-confidence. This is my manager's office. And then here we've got the finished product of the reception desk, excuse me, the uh, nurse's station desk. Um, we've got a couple of nurse's station workstations and then we've got the operating room beyond. We've got a glass wall that we're gonna be putting switch glass on, which is pretty cool, but of course it's not done yet, so it's clear still. The switch glass, when you flip a button, it frosts. So kind of like an LCD screen that goes on the glass. So. This is our treatment room seven. There's Tammy doing her work. We have uh, in the operating room, we've got lots of great windows, which I'm really excited about. We've been operating mostly in caves throughout my career, and this is gonna be really nice to be able to see you outside, know what time of day and, and what the weather's like, and just have a lot of nice, natural, bright light, which is gonna be good. Our scrub area, and then our, our uh, instrument processing and medical storage space. And then this way, we've got another treatment room here. This is where our nurse, Lori Mitchell, is gonna be doing most of her treatments. We have a laser in here. Uh, we'll be doing other minimally invasive treatments as well. So my office, and then restroom, a break room, another back salt wall, which this is for the sub waiting for my patients who are post-operative so that they can come through the back door and have a little privacy. This is gonna be the spa side. Nobody should be in here now, but we have five treatment rooms here. We have a, a facialist room. And they're pretty much all the same. We have, uh, depends upon the treatment that we're doing as to which room we use. So these are the same. We have one that's a dual treatment room and then this is our Thermi room where we use our, our uh, Thermi Smooth, Thermi Erase or Thermi Tight equipment um, or Thermiva as well. So more massage rooms or treatment rooms as necessary. And then we're back in the, on the spa reception side We've got lockers and restrooms and change rooms. And then over here is where we're going to be doing our, our drip therapy uh, for our patients. 
So the entrance to the to the outdoor space is through this door. We're going to have a, a bit of a division there so that you can get privacy when you're using the infrared sauna um, and yet still use the other side of the space. And we're planning on putting a fountain out there as well. So, and then this takes us back into reception. So now you see the finished product. Well, almost finished. Let's say it's we're in and we're functioning. It's probably 95%. We've got a lot of other details to put into place, but I'm excited to have it done. So come and see us, the Aesthetic Center of Eldorado Hills.